In today's video, we're going to talk about ordering and comparing numbers in a concrete way. We've just made two numbers, 3,327 and 1,235. You can see that we've made these in a concrete way because we've used the deans. When you use the deans, you can count the value of each of the numbers easily. So how do we know which one has the greatest value? When we're looking at comparing numbers, we always start in the thousands place. In my top number, 3,327, I have three thousands in the thousands place. Down below, I have 1,235. If I compare my 3,000 with 1,000, we know that 3,000 is the greater value. Therefore, this number has a larger value. Here you can see we've made two different numbers. On the top, we've got 1,414, and on the bottom, we've got 1,142. So how can we tell which number's greatest value when both of the thousands numbers are the same? In our two numbers, we can tell that they each have one in the thousands place. So we need to move to the right to the hundreds. We can see in the top number that we have 400 in the hundreds place. Down below, we only have 100. Therefore, 1,414 is larger than 1,142 because we know that 400 is larger than 100. We have made two new numbers, 1,221 and 1,236. As you can see, we have the same value in the thousands and the hundreds place. So, what do we do now? When the numbers are the same in the thousands and the hundreds place, we need to take a look at the tens. You can see in the top number, we have two tens, which is 20, and in the bottom number, we have three tens, which is 30. That means that the bottom number has the greatest value. We've made two more numbers, 1,223 and 1,225. As you can see, the digits in the thousands, hundreds, and tens place are the same. So we look to the ones. Our bottom number has five in the ones place. Our top number has three in the ones place. We know that five is greater than three, therefore our bottom number has the larger value. So remember, when we're comparing the value of two numbers, always start by looking at the thousands place, then the hundreds place, then the tens, and finally the ones. 